Hey, this is Video Bob from Bob's Prop Shop. This is our latest time machine. This is uh, our shop time machine. Um, and this has the plutonium reactor, which we've done before on car number 13, but not to the level like this. You can hear the plutonium chamber humming. Uh, if, you, if you're watching on a phone or something, you might not be able to hear it because it's a really low resonance. But it's uh, the sound of a plutonium chamber. So let's go ahead and simulate uh, how it worked in the movie. Over here I have my plutonium case. This case came from Universal Studios. This is legit. And uh, this is plutonium. Now, normally you would want to wear a, uh, you know, a, a protection for this, but I've been around plutonium so long that it just doesn't bother me anymore. All right, let's, let's take off the lid. Check this out. Now this is uh, all real machined aluminum and metal. And uh, you can see that uh, now the color has changed red because we are in red plutonium mode. We're going to put the cylinder in, just so. And you have to carefully set it into place, rotate it. You have to be careful. And it's very delicate. Oh, that, there we go. There, now it's taking the plutonium. Let's put the lid back in place. This is tricky because you have to do it softly. You don't want to cause any sparks. There we go. And you can see it's all safe now. We're back in yellow mode. And uh, it's nice and safe. Check out the license plate out of time. This is my out of time plate. Now, what's really cool is when you go into the future, I go back and forth from 85 and, and 2015. So it's a lot of trouble to take this thing off and change license plates. So check this out. Nobody's ever done that before. Bang, now I got my 2015 plate and I'm ready to go. So uh, I'm Video Bob and thanks for checking out Bob's Frop Shop.